Well, new information tonight on the drug fentanyl. A new report from the Centers for Disease Control shows it is now the deadliest drug in the country. Local 33's Amber Smith takes a look at the trends of the synthetic opioid right here in Baton Rouge. Fentanyl is now the deadliest drug in the United States. That's according to a new report from the Centers for Disease Control. It's a growing problem across the country, including right here at home. Fentanyl has become the next chapter to the opioid epidemic story. This chart from the CDC takes a look at opioid deaths and what drugs were used for that. It takes a look at it over the years. As you can see, from 2011 to 2016, fentanyl has gained exponential popularity. We are seeing a similar trend here. So far this year, there have been 80 overdose deaths in East Baton Rouge. At least 22 of those involve fentanyl. Fentanyl has been on the same or identical trend as heroin. It just showed up a little bit later uh, to, the, uh, to the scenario. Uh, we saw heroin come on the scene between 2012 and 2013, and then shortly after that in 2014 to 2016 is when the fentanyl numbers began to trend upward. According to the U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration, fentanyl is a synthetic opioid that is 80 to 100 times more powerful than morphine. In some cases, fentanyl is laced into other drugs. That's something Clark has seen happening here in East Baton Rouge. What had happened in this case was uh, he had probably gone to his uh, drug dealer and asked for cocaine, and the drug dealer gave him fentanyl instead. Uh, and he had a massive fentanyl overdose as a result of it. The opioid epidemic has been a top priority for area officials as of late. Just last week, the Capital Area Behavioral Health Collaborative unveiled a community-wide plan on how to stop this growing problem. For Local 33, I'm Amber Smith. And you can see the full CDC overdose report and the community-wide response plan to opioids by visiting this story on our website. That's BRProud.com.